I don't want to be a big fucking damper like, oh, life is just fucked up. But I mean, uh, it is crazy out here, okay? <laughs> What's up, Rose Petal Gang? I'm just leaving McDonald's because I definitely gotta have my coffee, baby. I ain't trying to have no motherfucking um, caffeine headache. I know my um, caffeine has know what I'm talking about. Let you try to um, <laughs> let you try not drink coffee. I'm like, fuck, I'm gonna turn on the camera. You don't talk to my rose petals. And then I'm kind of pissed off because I went to get my coffee and now me just pulling off, I'm realizing this shit's like half full. Like, well, like three fourths full. Like, first of all, there's no reason why this shit should be three fourths full. And like, honestly, and that was why I was gonna turn on the camera anyway. Nigga, a lot of shit just been getting on my fucking nerves. I've been trying to stay on some real, like, positive vibe shit. You know what I'm saying? Because there's already a lot going on. It's like, you know, stay positive through the bullshit. But it's like, a, a, I'm only human. You feel what I'm saying? I'm only fucking human. And it's like, a lot of shit been, been just bugging me lately. Like, this whole virus shit, we already know this shit's out of, this shit's more than out of hand, baby, okay? Then, it's like, with this whole virus shit, like, I'm taking a lot of stuff into perspective because it's like, tomorrow is like, never promised as we all know but this virus shit this gives you the reminder that tomorrow really the fuck ain't promised like for real so it been having me just put more things to perspective especially having so much time to think and you know in the house and you know what i'm saying having time to yourself and shit but it's crazy like it's like a lot of people are not taking this shit seriously it's like how do you not take how do you not take it serious like in my city, well, my city's ratchet as fuck. Y'all know I'm from Boston. Like, ooh, this potholes is fucking crazy, but y'all know how I'm from Boston and shit or whatever. And it's like everybody's just still ratchet as fuck. Like, people still out here getting shot. <clears throat> Females out here still fighting and shit. Raggedy ass niggas still cheating. It's just like what is the real tea like what the fuck is going on like and it's just like it makes you think like when with this virus shit being such a big thing to go wrong it makes you want to look for some good in the world you know what i'm saying it makes you want to look for some good and make you want to like be positive about something and it's like yo i've been everywhere i've been turning it just been stupid shit after stupid shit like you know i'm grateful for a lot of things life can definitely be worse for me you feel what i'm saying so don't get me wrong it's just like we live like it's just really making me it's really just making me come to the realization like we live amongst a bunch of like stupid like out of focus fucked up mindset ass people it's like how can you still be acting like a damn fool at a time like this you know what i'm saying like how can you be still acting like a damn fool at a time like this like Ugh, I hate when I'm talking on the camera and dudes be trying to like look at me like he look at him like I want to put the camera on him but he keeps moving up every time I move up at the red light he's moving up with me like <sighs> y'all <laughs> yo I'm over everything like yo leave me the fuck alone I'm over here trying to rant you over here trying to look at me what to get cussed the fuck out what you wanna do look at him y'all look oh look at him for real now y'all Oh, he turned his head. Oh, he turned his head. Like, boo, do you want to be on camera? Why you want to be looking at me? You want to get cussed up? Be on camera? What you want to do, baby? Okay. I was really about to put his ass on camera. Like, I'm just tired of everybody. And it's just like, <clears throat> I don't know. It's like a lot of things I've been putting into perspective, especially with seeing all this bullshit in the news and the media and stuff like that. I don't know. I just feel like. I don't know, the world's just fucked up. <laughs> and I don't want this to be like a fucked up, depressed ass rant, but that's literally how I feel, y'all. Like, mad shit is just fucked up. Like, it's crazy. That's why I've been trying to bring, you know, funny, silly content and stuff like that because we all just looking up. We all just looking out for some type of fucking hope, some type of good, some type of something. And it's like, 
mad shit is just dumb. Like, I don't know. I'm just over it. Like, I don't know. What are you guys' plans for after this quarantine shit? Like, once this is over, like, what are you guys' plans? Because you gotta even put that into perspective. Like, if we make it out of this shit, ooh. I'm over here talking to y'all. The whole ambulance is behind me, y'all. Child. <laughs> okay? But if we make it out of this shit, you feel what I'm saying? Like, we... This is some real, like... I feel like this is almost a game of fucking, like, survival of the fittest or some shit. My bad, y'all. I got a phone call. I got another phone call, y'all. But I don't know, y'all. I'm, I feel like I'm being, like... I don't know. I feel like I'm in my feelings or something right now. I don't know. <laughs> I guess this is in her feelings this morning, y'all. I'm in my fucking feelings, y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. Like, it's like watching everybody just operate wearing gloves and masks and shit. It's just like, then you, then I'm like driving by, like, um, well, the people that know about the Boston area, I'm over there driving by, like, near Mass Ave and shit. That's where all the crackheads and, like, homeless people be at. And I'm just looking and seeing them on the side of the road. I'm like, yo. Like a pack of 40 of them motherfuckers just on the side of the road. I'm like, yo, this is depressing. Like, I think that's just why I feel like that today, y'all. But I'm going to be okay. You know what I'm saying? I'll be all right. Y'all know I laugh fuck with y'all like talking to y'all about everything. Plus, I'm just trying to stay consistent as fuck. So, whenever I get the urge to pick up the cameras, like, why not just pick the bitch up? You know what I'm saying? So... I'm going to do a better video later on today. I'm going to drop a better video than this later on. I don't know. I was just in my feelings right now, y'all. You know what I'm saying? But um, I'll be all right. I'm going to put some pep in my motherfucking step. Probably eat a little something, something. Have a few drinks, something, something, something. You know what I'm saying? And get it together, baby. Get it back together, baby. Okay? It was just that. It was just too much going on out here for me. Like, dead ass seriously. Like, the vibes is just looking real depressing, y'all. But, um, like I was saying, I'm doing a smash a pass video, um, part two smash it past my subscribers part two so um I, I got a lot of pictures already but if you want to be in it definitely um drop that picture in because those videos are always fun you know what i'm saying so we need to i need to lighten up the mood y'all i don't want to be a big fucking damper like oh life is just fucked up but i mean uh it is crazy out here okay <laughs> it is fucked up out here y'all it is fucking depressing like i feel like everybody just need to realize we only got one fucking life to live and make the most out of it you know what i'm saying make the most about it stop worried about stupid shit stop being stop being a whole negative vibe stop being a fucking hater stop being a loser stop being just a fucked up individual like you know what i'm saying just like it's just so much shit going on it's like you should just try to at least be that one person and it's like oh this person's cool like this person's a real motherfucker like this person's a real vibe like every time i'm around this motherfucker i feel good i'm laughing or you know i'm feeling good something I, I feel like motherfuckers just be out here like, I don't know, y'all, just lost, lost and fucking miserable and mad and it, and it just affected the whole fucking world, okay? It's just a domino effect, but, um, I love y'all. Like I said, drop them, um, drop them selfies in my DM, my Instagram DM or Twitter or you can email it to me, okay? I'm like, you can even motherfucking mail mail it to me, baby, okay? Nah, but on a, um on some real shit. Um, all the information to my direct messages in the description box below. Follow and follow me too. <laughs> Don't just drop the picture, baby. Follow, follow your girl. Let me get. And I'll be back with little sham sham later. I, I should be feeling alright later. I love y'all. You got it, girl. You got it. You got it. I don't wanna. Life is good. <laughs>